Hello, Ori. I thought that it would be fun for us to draw Bucky Badger today. So you can grab some paper and markers or pencil or crayons, whatever you have, some sidewalk chalk, and make a Bucky Badger with me. So when we make Bucky Badger, we are going to start with a football shape. We're only going to be making his head, so the football shape is going to be about in the middle of where you're drawing. All right, next I am going to put a basketball shape in the bottom part of his head. This is going to be for his nose. All right, next we're going to add some stripes to his face. So I'm going to make some lines, straight lines that go up from the circle, right in the middle. So we've got two straight lines, and then I'm going to add two curved lines on the outside of the straight line. So I'm going to go up, and then when I get about halfway, I'm going to curve out on one side, and then on the other side, up and curve out. All right, Ooh, I'm going to make that a little shorter. Here we go. Okay, next I'm gonna add some stripes to the sides of his face. So when I do that, I'm gonna make a little curved line right here. And then I'm going to make some mountains going out. I'm gonna make three points to my mountain. So short, long, short three mountains, short, long, and short. And I'm gonna do it again on the other side. Little curved line, short, long, short. All right, next I'm gonna add some eyes, just little ovals, one there and one there. He's starting to look like Bucky. Now I'm going to make a nose. So right here and right here, kind of like a curved triangle. And then I can add his mouth. Straight line down. Curve and then another curve on the other side. Since he is Bucky Badger, we need to add some teeth right there and some ears. So the ears, kind of like the nose, is going to be like a triangle but curved. On this side and on this side. Oh, let's make him this one. It's all right if you make a mistake. I'm going to make that one a little bit bigger, I think. There we go, so that they're kind of the same. And then I can add a little line right here and a little line right here. There. Now, you can finish your Bucky right how it is just like this, or you can add some more details. You can color in some of the parts black. So Bucky has this part colored in black on this side, and his stripe over here. You can color in black This stripe I can color in. I can color in this one. I can color in his nose.
there we go. All right, then if you wanna add some more details, Bucky Badger is sometimes a little bit fluffy around the outside, so you can do this. This will work if you're using like a pencil or maybe even chalk or a whiteboard marker like what I'm using because you'll have to do a little bit of erasing. So I see my straight lines that I have here. I can just kind of go in and make them look kind of shaggy. And then if you have an eraser, you can erase those straight lines out and just keep your shaggy lines like that. Then I'll do the same thing on the other side, just making some zigzags going out to the point. I can do it on the top. These don't need to be perfect. Just kind of however it looks good to you. Okay, so now he's kind of shaggy. I'm gonna add some little bit of some shaggy lines, some short lines coming out from his ear on one side. I can do that again on the other side. I'm gonna have him say, grr. All right. And our buggy badger is done. Now, yours probably looks different than mine. Maybe you made the ears bigger. Maybe you made his head more round. Maybe you didn't color it in. Maybe you colored him in a different color. But that's all right, because that just shows us that you are using your own personal drawing style, which is awesome. Not everybody is, is going to look the same, and that, was, that is what makes them look really cool. So I hope everyone enjoyed drawing Bucky Badger with me today and enjoy the rest of your day.